Alright guys, uh, I want to show you uh, today trap in Italian game. Let's make the first moves. Knight f3, knight c6, bishop to c5, and knight to f6. So this is two knights defense for um, uh, Joko Piano. Knight to g5, uh, the main move. Another move is d3, but um, knight to g5 is okay. d5, e takes d5. Uh, taking is not possible. Taking is possible, but this is fried liver attack, which is good for white. So you don't have to do it. And here, in this position, black plays strange move. Uh, knight to d4. Um, so, um, removing the knight from attack and uh, moving in forward, threatening something like bishop to g4. Now, white will take a look at the position and they attack the f7, so the only problem is pawn on d5, so they play d6. In this position, black takes with the queen, sacrificing the pawn on f7. So, uh, two pieces have option to take on f7, and uh, the good choice for uh, white is to take on f7 with the knight, why not? So they take the pawn and they make a fork to queen and to rook. Queen to c6, removing the queen from attack and attacking the bishop and attacking the pawn on g2. So uh, you cannot just move uh, the bishop, let's say, to b3 because we will capture it. And uh, the good move here for white is to take on h on h8. So they are uh, rook up and uh, a pawn. And here black takes on g2. They are already winning. So this rook attacked and uh, uh, the knight here starts to play. So white want to save the rook rook h1, and here black gives this unpleasant check on e4. So, uh, if white goes bishop back to e2, then it's knight f3, mate. And if white plays queen to e2, because they have to protect from check then, black takes the queen, bishop takes, and this position is easily winning for black because they are a queen up all right thank you very much see you next time